thank you for clicking on this video. Today I want to talk about four ministers of the Gospels that I listen to regularly. Um, if you're interested in learning more about these people and kind of what they have been standing for in my life, keep watching. So to all the new subscribers, welcome, welcome, welcome. And to all my oldies, thank you for coming back. So today I'm going to talk about four people that um, have played a tremendous role in my walk with Christ. Um, and the first thing I want to do is to give a disclaimer. Now, although I want to talk about people that proclaim the gospel, I think it's important to emphasize the fact that you need to know the word for yourself. Preaching of the gospel is absolutely essential, but if you don't know the word for yourself, it's hard to decipher between between what is true and what is not true. And we all know that humans are capable of human error. So it's important to know the word and have your own personal relationship with God so that when others are preaching about him and teaching about him, you're able to rightly divide it and also digest it. So let's keep on going this video. with I'm going to talk about uh, John Piper so I've been following John Piper for about six years my husband was the one that introduced um, me to his platform and I really enjoy his teachings he is truly authentic to the gospel and to the word he is an ex exegetical I think I said that right or maybe I didn't teacher so he literally goes verse by verse chapter by chapter um most people know him from his platform called uh desiring god and his podcast that i listen to probably daily um that's called ask pastor john i follow him because i i have uh learned um, learned much about the, the theological part of our faith and I think it's important to have the theological firm foundation um, when studying the scriptures and also just walking with Christ and so he's done an amazing job of just through his walk and he's been walking with Jesus for over almost 60 years and so he has learned so much has a wealth of wisdom and God uses him so tremendously on his platform and so he is one of the primary people that I uh, go to as far as platforms when I have questions about certain things and when I'm not sure about certain things um, he has an array of resources that um, I go to 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 learn more so yeah so John Piper and I'll put um, Desiring God's um, YouTube page or his uh, Ask Pastor John YouTube page right here. The next pe person or I should say group because they're more so a family is Tony Evans. And so Tony e Evans has this family of amazing and they had an amazing wife she just passed last year and this amazing group of children who are all pursuing God in different forms of ministry some of you might know Priscilla Shire and that is one of his children um so the reason why I follow not just Tony Evans but his family is because I've learned so much about the legacy of passing your the biblical truths down from generation to generation Lois was really 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 um adamant about about having a legacy of believers within her home and leaving that with her children and you can see amongst her children that they did a really good job by the grace of God of passing down uh, Jesus to the next generation and so I follow them because they talk about family dynamics they talk about uh, an array of biblical topics like the Priscilla Shire is really a uh, known a lot for the full armor of God um and she has wrote no she has written a lot of books so they just have a lot it's just a wealth of knowledge amongst their family and just like real life situations that they're very transparent about so uh yeah that's another uh family that I follow um on various social media platforms YouTube primarily um that talk about Jesus and love Jesus All right, another pastor that you might not have heard of because he's actually like a local pastor in Maryland. I actually found him through my best friend. He's my best friend's uh, pastor this past year, maybe like the past couple months actually. And his name is John Thompson. He is the pastor of Kingdom Life Community. And I have just by watching his YouTube page and the sermons, like, 
profound wisdom and knowledge and understanding of God and living a kingdom life. And so I love, love, love the way that he preaches and he passes on the word in such a way where it is digestible, but it is, it has so much depth and richness to it. Have you ever been to like the sermons or watch different teachings and it's like, okay, I have to watch this like two or three times to, to be able to not just chew it up, but to swallow it. And that's kind of what he comes with. Um, I, his wife is amazing as well. They are just, again, it's somewhat like uh, the Evans family, uh, they've passed on their faith to their children. They have a beautiful story. And, um, I follow them also again through the YouTube page. Um, they post typically every Monday or Tuesday, the sermons that he has on Sunday, but yeah, like true gospel, unadulterated, authentic word of God, like not trying to make it fancy for you, not trying to make it complicated, but just giving you the word. And I so richly am blessed by this pastor. Again, his name is John Thompson and I'll put their YouTube channel up here too in the cards. Last but not least, another person that I follow uh, regularly is Jen Wilkins. Now, Jen Wilkins is a, a woman who ministers a lot about women teaching women. So she kind of guides the leaders on how to minister to women. So she ministers to women on how to minister to women. So I follow her because I have a really deep desire to like just minister the word and teach and fellowship with women. And she does an amazing job on breaking down what it really looks like in leading women to Christ and walking and doing walking and doing life with women and so I follow her a lot of her sermons she's a part of a lot of the conferences that I have been a part of like she teaches a lot and so I follow her on YouTube as well um she's written a lot of books a lot of amazing books um and yeah, she, she's an amazing teacher as well, and I love following her. She's so funny, kind of goofy, um, very relatable, like very relatable, but still like super authentic. Like she's going to tell you the truth, but then you might giggle a little bit later. Um, so again, her name is Jen Wilkin, um, another person I will highly suggest if you are a woman who is walking with women um, in the faith. All right, guys, that wraps this video up. Thank you so much for watching. And I hope that this gave you a little, like little bits and pieces about people that um, I follow in the faith. Uh, I would love it if you would like, comment, and subscribe to this, vid this video. And make sure you hit that bell um, so that you can get any notifications of any updates that come through this channel. Again, thank you so much. And I will see you next week.